What up YouTube, Daniel4619 coming here with a one card mail day. As the doc used to say, unprecedented. This is unprecedented. So for the very first time, as far as I can remember, I picked up a non-sports card. And I will tell you, it feels different. I, I don't know how to really explain it, but holding a non-sports card just, it has a different feel to it. I don't know. Um, so, I didn't, um, with comps, I really wanted to get this card in my collection. And with comps there, I didn't need to really contact anybody. Um, I put up a beverage like Ed Wesker Griff. I don't know, I've been trying to drink this sparkling water. Um, but like, if there was no comps, then I would definitely be reaching out to some people and saying, look, I'm going after this. I need, I need some help here. Um, cause I don't want to, you know, pay twice as much as, you know, it should go for whatever currently, I mean. Um, so anyway, but yeah, uh, man, crazy, crazy. So yeah, I, he, he was, you know, like many kids, uh, childhood hero. Um, I don't know. We even had, there was somebody in my friend's neighborhood that tried to he looked sort of similar like him it was a, a some father or something he looked sort of similar and he would like get all dressed up and i don't know i i think he even gosh who knows he might even signed autographs <laughs> but he was trying to say he was him and all this but anyway um yeah that could be some legal issues but there is the things you don't think about as a kid, but now you think about, but anyway, without further ado, what you gonna do when the Hulkamania runs wild on you, brother? Yeah, brother. Oh man. On card autograph. So that came in today. And like, because I was, Carlos was saying, he said, I, you know, I don't know if he meant this card, so I don't want to take that out of context or anything, but he said there's wrestling cards that he could have meant this one. He could have not, I don't know, but he said there's with rest, there's, you know, a number of wrestling cards that when they go in people's collections, that that's it. Like they just don't see the light of day. So anyway, Numbered 45 of 99. Boy, he put his rope right over that five. But yeah, man. WWF. So very, very happy to get that in. Yeah, brother. I don't know. I almost feel like I'm sounding like uh like I sound like Randy Savage instead I don't know but Hook Hogan to 99 Alrighty well that will do it you two my first ever non man it just feels different I don't know it just it has a different feel to it you know, that would be, not that I'm going to do it, but that would be something if someone actually did that. Like, they were into sports cards, like, a whole bunch. And then, like, they got one non-sports card. And it just, like, opened up a floodgate. And they just started just only getting non-sports cards. That would be, I don't know. You just never, man, this hobby. Like, I mean, man, I always go back to Mike O said, he goes, man, you'll just find yourself in this hobby. Like, uh, you'll, you'll go through the, 
I don't know. You'll go through some waves and the ebbs and flows and you'll figure out what you like. Uh, I mean, you can be like me and there's things in the past I've picked up um, that I really, I don't know. I didn't like, I didn't like them as much as the price tag that I paid for them. But, um, you know, you live and you learn, right? So, right, right. So, and then Ed Wester Griff, don't take it so serious. You know, it's a hobby. So, anyhow. But, yeah, just, gosh. Like I said in the previous, collect what you like. But sometimes that could actually somehow be harder than it sounds. I don't know. Just... But, I, I mean, I don't want to say what I'm going to do in the future, but this is, I mean, I was like, look, I got to get a Hulk Hogan autograph. So, I mean, the other ones, I don't know. It, it, it's like, I don't want to say it's a one and done, but this is one that, out of all the wrestlers, I wanted to lock in. So, all right, YouTube, I've been rambling enough. But yeah, this is 2022 impeccable. Oh, you know what? And it has, yeah, it has that like grainy surface sort of. See the bumps in there? And so me with the way my mind works. I'm wondering if those bumps somehow, like, there's maybe some sort of pores in there, like a baseball that suck it up. I doubt it, but whatever it is, what it is. But, yeah, I'm, I'm glad. I was always wondering that. Well, now I got a card that, <laughs> if that ever did happen, I could actually see it from firsthand. <laughs> but I don't, I don't think that's the way it works. But uh, I bet you baseballs do that. They suck up the ink or something they got the pores but yeah this is it's not a flat flat smooth it has some sort of you can see that anyway all right so that's it youtube check you later